Hey YouTubers, it's Angel and I'm back. I am going to make, I'm just finishing up dinner and I'm going to make my um, caprese salad for the kids instead of the scalloped potatoes and the peas. So, lucky for me, I'm just sharpening my knife. Lucky for me, I have... Um, a garden where I grow my own tomatoes, my own basil. So that's what I'm going to be putting into my garden. So these are tomatoes from my garden. So there's Terry and there's Roma. And I'm going to slice these up. So everything that I don't, I'm not going to keep is going to go right in my compost bin. Um, I make stuff and people are like, why didn't you show the whole process? And um, it's normally my intention to do that. Doesn't always get done. So I'm just going to slice these in half. I don't like him. It's a really easy salad. And uh, it's going to... <laughs> my dog is right under my foot trying to get all the look at how juicy these tomatoes look it's just I love it And now for my cherry tomatoes. I'm just gonna. Cut these in four. So to add to my. To add to my caprese, I'm just gonna do simple some some mozzarella, and I'm gonna add some balsamic vinegar and salt and pepper. My mozzarella, and I think I already said that, but also some. Um, some basil straight from the garden. This basil is actually coming from my friend's garden. And this is uh, sweet Emily basil, which is pretty much your everyday basil it's the most common it's really amazing as soon as you um, open the bag you can smell it it's so amazing so I want to show you guys something so this this cut that I'm getting ready to make is called a chiffonade and how you do a chiffonade you take all the bait, you take everything, you stack it together, everything is rolled up together, you roll it like a cigar, and then you just I don't know if you can see that. make ribbon cuts. 
Okay, that's gonna go right in the salad. Love basil. I have my mozzarella. I'm gonna add. So I like this mozzarella. It is the babasso, and um, I get it from Sam's Club. So I'm not gonna do the whole thing because I don't know how much these kids are gonna like it. I am gonna add some more of the tomatoes, but I want you guys to see what the finished product looks like without having to wait for me to do. So I'm just gonna slice it, slice it. So basically in fours and then fours the other way. Now what's great about this mozzarella, first of all, is that it was on sale. I love the sale. But the also thing is that it's pre-sliced. So, that's bad. It's pre-sliced. But I'm not taking advantage of that feeder right. I'm going to break it up in the bowl. But because I want it smaller, I want little cubes, I'm not going to take it apart. I'll take it apart after. So I'm going to cut it in fours. Cheese is best cut when it's cold. So if you want to cut some cheese yourself, cut it when it's cold. Um, and if you want to shed cheese, Make it super cold. Put it in the freezer. Because then it's really easy to cut. So there's a little tip for you. Alright, so here's what my bowl is looking like. Breaking up my cheese. And then I'm going to add some... I am going to add some more tomatoes. This is really easy because the, the pork chops are actually in the oven. So, because it's late. And these kids just really want to get to the cobbler. <laughs> so, I'm going to get these a really quick slice. So, I did pre wash them. Uh, they're straight out of the garden, and they're grown with no pesticides. How do I know that? I grew them. <laughs> so. Um, but, you know, some of them have hit the ground, so. Quick rinse before you get to all the natural goodness. Alright, I'm going to make this my last cut. I'm going to add some more later. But right now I'm going to get Himalayan pink salt that I'm just going to add to that. Sorry, guys. So, here we go. Some a few sprinkles of sauce. Now, I know people don't like, a lot of people don't like salt, but you need it. It will make the tomatoes even sweeter. I'm going to shake this up. Now this is a white truffle balsamic glaze. 
Um, it's really good over mushrooms. I love it in spinach. And I'm using it right now because it was the first one I picked up and I didn't want to keep you guys waiting any longer than you already have. So now I'm going to give this a little, just a quick stir. Normally I add some crushed peppercorns in here. And I might put too much balsamic vinegar in here. But it's all good. And there you have it. My Caprizi salad. The kids are going to love it. Um, they're going to have that with their pork tops that is in the oven that is ready. So if you want, you guys can get a peek of the pork tops. I'm going to take them out. Oh, yeah. I don't want to spill it. <laughs> but there you go. See those pork chops? Can you see them? And those juices? They look to be perfectly done. Yeah. So that's what the kids are going to have for dinner tonight. I'm going to fix the plate so you can see their plate. Look at Turn it over. Yeah. Oh, this is a 12 minute video. You guys get the drift. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, share, and subscribe. This is Angel, and this is on What Did You Do Today? And you guys know everything that I did. I did my granddaughter's hair. I did box braids with extensions, and um, I made a candle. You didn't get to see that. I'm still working on that. Um, I made a peach cobbler. I made homemade... Uh, Caramel whipped cream and then dinner pork chops baked pork chops and a caprese salad So I hope you guys enjoyed my channel today Please like share and subscribe